Hello and welcome to another PB Reviews. We have this month, this month being June's Nerd Block. June's Nerd Block, what do you think of that? I don't know. Not until we find out what's in it, I suppose. Yeah. So, it's going to have a t-shirt and it's going to have some other stuff in it. Uh, yeah. I think they promised a Ghostbusters item, didn't they? Yeah, I know what it is, I think. I'm not sure. Right, do you want to take the first thing out? Oh! Take a deep breath. It is. What is it? You explain. It's Groot. It is a Dorb's Groot. <laughs> it looks cute. It's a cute Groot. Please, can I have him in my bedroom? Yes, you can have him. There we go. Uh, Dorbs are quite nice little things. Uh, um, sometimes I prefer them to Funko Pops because they're just so cute, the pictures on them. So that's really nice. Um, next up, we have. Um, oh, and this looks like another graphic novel. I like the fact that some of them are putting in graphic novels now instead of comics. The comics are, are great, but the, you only get the first issue and then you want to read the rest. You've got a graphic novel, you've got the whole thing. And this is, oh, this is actually Tobin's Spirit Guide. If, you re if you've watched Ghostbusters, you'll know that they refer to Tobin's Spirit Guide as the, the ultimate guide on, on ghosts and spirits. There we go. So you've got lots of different pages. It's not a graphic novel. It's a book. Cool. Um, and it's basically loads of different ghosts okay, and spirits. Okay, I hate that picture there. It's freaking me out. Well, some of them will be scary, won't they? But luckily, Groot. So, that's really nice, actually. I wasn't expecting that at all. But luckily, that's, that's Groot great. can guard me. Yes. Uh, do you want to pick another item? Yeah. Wait, I want to pick two. Pick this one first of all. I'll just pick this one. I don't know what it is. I'm just gonna pop in the middle. Usually a poster if it's in one of those. That feels weird. Oh, it's a scroll. I want to open the scroll. You have to open it carefully. Yay. It's, it's wrapped like yeah, an old scroll that you found. It was just in a tube like this. It's a. Yeah. Guide to the treasure. Uh, it doesn't have any idea. It's like a Pirates of the Caribbean type thing, if I was to guess. There we go. It's quite nice because it looks kind of almost authentic. Yeah. Well, you can touch it and, and realise it's um, like a material. But um, I think that's quite nice, isn't it? It actually does look like a map from here, but when yeah. you touch it, it looks like it doesn't. It's a little treasure map, so that's quite good if you want to do like role playing or, or dress up at school. You've got a little treasure map. If you want to do a pirate, you've got the opportunity to do that. Although you're not that keen on pirates, are you? No. Right, okay, next item. Do you want to take that one? Yay! Yeah, you can do the next one. It's a I know bookmark. you had your eye on that. It's a bookmark. What kind of bookmark? A Harry Potter bookmark. A Harry bookmark. Potter bookmark from Gryffindor. So it's it got the Gryffindor coat of arms from the house Gryffindor from the school. And yeah, a badge. Gryffindor badge. There we go. It found something that. cool and small in here. There's a small cool thing. Shall I take that out? I'll have a look at that. It is a Rob Stark copper star from Game of Thrones. So it's the uh, the coin that they'd use in the north, I guess. If you could see that very clearly. How do they nice. make that coin? Well, the same way they make a normal coin, but um, Is it specially an made with a coin. Well, no, it's from a TV series from Game of Thrones. Oh, so it's not real. No, but it's um, it's made as if it was real. Okay. It's quite nice it's in a nice little presentation pack. So shall I? Uh, yeah. Sure. I don't know what this is of. Have a look and see. Oh, it's Link. Oh, oh, why is he looking chat? through? No, he's looking through a, like, like a diamond chat. thing. You can just about see Link peeking out through there. So it's a nice little Zelda shirt. I'm peeking out through the top. 
So I don't think I've got, I think I've got one Zelda shirt and that's it. So it's quite nice. That's another addition. And of course, the new Legends of Zelda on the Wii U and then coming to the NX as well is looking fantastic. It was one of the best looking games of E3. Um, so I'm pleased to have that. I look forward to playing the new one. Excellent. Um, let's have a look and see what else there is. There's the usual um, temp ten dollars off which you can collect all of them and get hundred dollars off i haven't looked on the website yet to see what the exclusions are there must be some catch somewhere uh the thing saying what you got so that's tobin's spirit guide um the harry potter gryffindor bookmark the guardians of the galaxy daubs also it's quite lucky that you got i don't know if you can see there was um star lord as well so you got Groot, which was quite lucky wasn't it and it's goonies map i should have realized that i thought it was a pirates but i was wrong it was goonies it was goonies you've seen goonies haven't you oh I swear and then there's a legend of zelda um there's three rupees well, in three different colors oh, i wanted a sapphire i like the red one that's nice <laughs> the ruby one <laughs> Um, and Game of Thrones coins. So you got loads. Of, is that the same coin? Oh no, it's, it's a different coin. Yeah, there's different coins I think for different people. So that's good. So I think that was a really nice box. You're happy with your Groot, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. So June's box is really good. Well done, Nerd Block. Uh, next month there will be Suicide Squad and ooh Transformers. I want to watch. And Attack on Titan Squad. as well. Squad. Can I watch it? Watch what? Suicide Squad. Uh, we'll see. I think it's going to be a 12A. So, yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. Wait, okay. I well, there we go. What did you think of that box overall? Do you like it? Yes. You like that? Is there anything else you liked as well? No. No, just that. Well, I liked everything in there. I thought it was quite a nice selection today. It's something interesting. And Tobin's Spirit Guide is great. I can go in my bookshelf with my geeky books. Right. Well, let us know what you thought um, as you watch the video or if you got it yourself and what you thought of the box. And please like and share us. Isn't that right? Yeah, I can share. <laughs> and we'll see you again soon with another unboxing. Thanks for watching and goodbye. Bye.